All right, welcome in everybody. Good morning. It is 8:37. I love having these little rants to myself that I just know the ones I can't record and upload on YouTube. I'd just be sitting in my room. I hear some shit that pisses me off on the news or whatever. I'll just go on just like a long rant. Just let it all out. Don't hold back. And that shit makes you feel great. There's a lot of dumbass motherfuckers in this country. Like George Carlin said 30 years ago. And these fat bastards love to eat. They love to eat. All Americans love to do. Eat, tell lies, get misinformed, and get up and go to work. Dumbasses. Anyways, we're going to uh, send this uh, San Diego and Cincinnati series, and uh, we're going to uh, scout that team, find out who we're going to be playing in the first round of the playoffs. I can frustrate living in this country. Too informed. Too intelligent to live here. Dude, people just don't want to learn anything. Anyways. And you can I mean, call me arrogant or whatever. Nah, motherfucker. It's confidence. I can back it up. If you want to debate me, we can do that. If you want to play the game, we can do that. I can back up anything I say. It's called confidence. You don't see much of that these days. Anyways, let's end this series. I'm personally pulling for um, San Diego because Cincinnati's got some fucking. I mean, you really can't go. I mean, Cincinnati has the better um, offense. San Diego has a better pitching staff. So, you know, I'll play anybody. So it is what it is. Let's send this bad boy. All right, this I think this game decides it. Wow, the Reds advance. Okay, so we're playing the um, 3C Cincinnati Reds. We'll go ahead and um, scout them in this video. Okay. They had Jake Fraley. One time this guy hit two home runs in a playoff game against me one time, and I titled it the Fraley Double. I thought that was pretty uh pretty clever. Um he's good. Good lead off here, but not great. I know how to deal with him. We played the Reds earlier this season. I played like two, three games out of this series. So I got a pretty good uh grasp of what their lineup does and doesn't do. This is a guy I had bad lead off. Five three war player. Jonathan India is really good. 3A War, Ellie. Oh, this dude, man, I was thinking in my mind the other day when I was playing a game, this dude is like a clone of, of O'Neill Cruz. They're the same guy. They're both really tall shortstops. They both hit for power. They both, they're both fast. They do the exact same things. They both play good defense. He's O'Neill Cruz. Five War. Like, these top five batters are insane. They're going to give me fits. Four War for Spencer Steer. How do you get the last name Steer? What is dad fucking cow? The fuck? <laughs> it was Tyler uh, Stevenson. Oh my god. There's like fucking 30 war between these guys alone. GJ Friedel, Friedel, Friedel. Four war. What the fuck? Man, war really likes these guys. And somehow that's a negative war. Well, I have to see how this name. These guys aren't good at all. You probably shouldn't be playing. But they have no other third baseman on the bench. What the fuck? So that guy gets hurt, they're kind of screwed. Who's going to play third base? Oh, um, man, there's no reason to look at that. So the uh, basically the bottom two spots in the lineup are holes. Like, how is this a four? Like, how are these numbers impressive? I get it. They're, like, average. Like, 750 OPS is pretty good. 800 plus is great in my eyes. Like, I, I just don't understand how war works. Okay, anyways, um, this doesn't really matter. Um, you never see him anyways. Uh, Nick, what? Oh, it's out of order. I was about to say, their best pitch is a 78. Nope. We got to face Hunter Green. Wait a minute. If they use Hunter Green in the series against San Diego, I wonder if he's even available. Or he might be available, like, late in our series. He's incredible. I had him before on a Braves franchise in the past. He was He pitched like this. Ton of strikeouts. Not that many innings. Andrew Abbott is incredible. Face him a billion times. Man, they got all these strikeout guys. So these guys may be looking look uh, 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 terrible, helpless in the past. I've also looked good against them. It's split 50-50. Nick Lodolo is great, too. Man, damn. We may have finally met our match, boys. I hope not. I hope we can uh, face Nick Martinez. So he's giving up a lot of hits, which bodes well for us. Graham Ashcraft gives him a lot of his goes well for us. High ERA. If we can, man, if we can beat these guys, 
And if we just get one of these guys, we can win the series. That's literally all we need. Beat the two bad guys, win one against the good guys. The uh, bullpen is, is good. Bullpen is good. Who's their closer? Their closer get hurt or something? They have, like, no closer here. Wait, what? Who's their closer? Did he not make the playoff roster? I'm confused. Wait, is this guy? Why? What? Why is he not their closer? He's great. He only blew four saves. He's 60 Ks in 48 innings. 263 one away. Why? Why is he not the fucking closer? What is wrong with this game? Why would they do this? A guy with a 5 and 290 RA? Okay. Good. I like that. I like that dumb shit. Make it easy for me. Anyways, that's the Reds. Um, here's what we're going to run out there. Um, let me see what order I want. That. I think I want to run out. Uh, yeah. Jillian's uh, is for nine rating. It's not great. Then again, nobody's. It's great. Except Aphrodite. Uh, Jillian... The number, like, the, the, the hits per nine is bad. Case per nine isn't great. Like, homers per nine is, like, middle of the road. But she had a great year. And with numbers like this, she's got to be my number two starter. She's, like, max freed on the good year numbers. Quinn Ridgeway. He's, like, Charlie Morton numbers. Zelda Sorensen. So I think, man, we're ready to rock. We um, we were ready. Uh, by the way, everybody got new hair. I went through, did a hair overall last night. Uh, after that, he's got double braids. Looking cute. Feeling cute. There she is. With her double braids. Why are they clipping through her back? Let's fix that while we're here. Okay, after that, he's got the double braids. Um, I, my favorite new hair is Paige. I don't expect everybody to watch the videos. 46 minutes long. I'm just going to show off a few of the good ones here. That's Paige looking like a model. Uh, Kaylin Winchester is great, too. They were my cover girls for the uh, hair overall video. Look at that. All right, but yeah, that's pretty much it. We're playing the Reds. We're running this out. This is the um, whole playoff roster. Girls with new hair got purple. Riley got purple. She's experimenting with new looks. Giselle's blonde. Le blonde. A lot of changes. Uh, Soy and Jim went blonde. Jessica or Jess. Rachel Papa's finally changed her hair. Dyed it blue. All right. I will see you when I see you. Go with Lady Braves.